Heading to Bangalore, where the wife of a local priest has surrendered to police. She was wanted in a hit and run, allegedly driving her car onto a footpath, killing one person and injuring three others, all said to be construction workers from Andhra Pradesh. That uh, on Saturday night, there's been a lookout for her since then. Police saying the woman was learning how to drive. She lost control of the vehicle. She had been identified by eyewitnesses. All right, for more, let's get in a word from Deepa Balakrishnan. She's joining us live from Bangalore. Deepa, there were eyewitnesses and she had been identified last night itself. Well, yes, there were eyewitnesses and she probably realized that she couldn't be on the run forever because there was a lot of, uh, uh, there were both a lot of evidence here. First of all, her car was seized. It was left at the site of the accident. Secondly, there were eyewitnesses because she is a resident of that area. She lived just two roads away. So everyone in that area who had seen her drive that car and walk away also recognized her. So she realized probably that she couldn't be on the run forever. Now, uh, what police officers are telling us is that she walked in with her husband and uh, she surrendered to the police so she will be taken to taken to a magistrate very soon and possibly post bail and get it now get out but the fact is that uh, earlier the offenses against her would have just been possibly rash and negligent driving but now that will be compounded with other offenses for instance that she was on a learner's license so she should have had ideally somebody with her uh, so that is a traffic violation secondly she walked away from the site of accident without giving police uh, any information or helping the victim which was most which is the most important thing so right. she was will be uh, charged with hit and run.